What up champions? It's a cold day today in Slovenia, so I'm gonna be quick and I'm gonna show you the most underrated exercise in calisthenics. Because I'm an advanced athlete, I've been training for calisthenics for what, 10 years? And still, to this day, I'm doing this exercise. Before we get into it, for everybody who's interested and passionate about training, as most of you probably are, make sure to join our Facebook group if you haven't yet. So click the link right here below the video and uh, join our Facebook group. So right now, we're gonna get to the exercise. So as you can see, we have have the rings right here and what might that exercise be so the exercise is rows or australian pull-ups so rows horizontal pulling boom if you want to develop a strong good looking back if you want to develop good lats you got to do some rows and right now i'm just going to before we get into the exercises show you basically three distinct variations number one we pull right here. Majority of people are doing this one 100% of the time. You should be doing at least two different variations of rows. The first one majority of people are doing is this one. Elbows a bit wider, working the upper back. Very, very good stuff, but very poor lat engagement. Why do we need the lat? We need it for the front lever, we need it for any type of pulling strength. So if you want to improve your lat strength, don't pull here, pull, boom right here elbow close to the body is what gets us that lat activation and the third variation is even greater lat activation meaning instead of pulling right here with our elbow close pulling to the chest we pull further down to our waist so here and pulling down to our waist with really elbows close to the body right here you get the maximum engagement in the lat. Right now let me show you the different progressions so you can start working on improving your row and improving your back strength and getting that quality muscle mass. basic variations of rows to develop strong good looking back and make sure you focus on at least two different progressions so one for the upper back one specifically for the lat to really get the transfer to the front lever and if all the variations everything i show you right now is freaking way too easy even for hypertrophy then make sure to add a weighted vest or if even that is too easy then make sure to focus on the next rowing progression which is the front lever pull up or the front lever row so there you have your entire body weight freaking 80 kg 60 kgs 90 kgs whatever it is you weigh you have to pull your entire body weight up there so the third front lever row or advanced third front lever row or front lever pull up would be the next progression for all of those seriously advanced athletes who really want to develop just ridiculous back strength so that's about it for this video make sure you're working on your pull-ups and chin-ups but make sure not to skip the row because it's just a beautiful fantastic exercise to develop that strong back and just a great injury pre prevention exercise as well thank you guys so much for your attention and your time make sure to do some rows make sure to join our facebook group and i'll see you in another video take care bow champion you know it